vibing. When I come around, got the whole thing wobbing. Hey, what's going on, fellow members of the Prank Squad? It's your boy Cole here with a brand new video. I'm getting pumped. I'm excited. This is going to be a super positive video. No more negative videos because today is the very first episode of Motivational Monday. That's right. We have brought a brand new series to you guys, motivating you guys every single Monday whenever we can. We will try and do this every single Monday for as long as we can. And we just really need your motivation to do mo Motivational Monday. So the first motivation, motivational Monday is going to be about your life, living your life, doing the things you want to do in life, finding happiness, and we're just going to basically cover basically everything in life out of a quick little talk. Now these videos should only be about 10 minutes, 5 to 10 minutes, and they're good because you can quick, they're quick, you can watch them on the go, and um, we're just trying to send the channel through a positive stage in life right now and we want to make the channel a positive really positive and a good way to do that is to um through doing motivational monday and sharing our own experience so this first motivational monday is going to be very special because hopefully it's the start of something new and the start of something that everyone's gonna love and that's something really cool about sharing in doing YouTube videos is you make what you want to make and you create your own content and this is something that we can create and be proud of so right off the bat I'm gonna just say what you're living right now is called life this is your life this is you being you living your life so make it your own do what you love if you're not doing what you love right now you're not living your life you're living someone else's life if you're working for someone that you don't like working for, you're living their life because you're not doing what you want to do. And do what you love. Do it a lot. Do it often. Do it as much as you can because when you're not doing the things you love, you're not happy. You're not living life to its fullest because you're living life in dread and tiredness and just not wanting it to end. And it keeps going, keeps going. You want it to end, you want it to end. And it, if it just terrible and that goes with, without saying if you don't like something change it if you're in your life that negative thing that's driving you nuts whether it's a job or a job or I don't know talking to whatever you know what I mean if, if there's something negative in your life that is hurting how you live your life in happiness or hurting this or that change it right away cut it out of your life it doesn't need to be there if you don't have enough time to live and enjoy happiness, then stop doing the things that don't matter. Video games, TV, sometimes even YouTube, which is hard to say. Browsing the internet, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, whatever it is, stop doing it. Make more time for happiness. Happiness is really important to your life, and it's something everyone has to learn eventually, and it's one of the things that I've learned. And the next, I mean, it's just that you got to keep looking for that next step in your life. And a lot of people are like, well, I don't have not enough time to do the things I like. I don't have enough time to be happy. I don't have enough time to cut the things out. I don't have enough time to quit my job. I don't have the motivation to quit my job. I don't have anywhere to go after I quit my job. But if you're doing what you love, that's all that matters. Now, I'm not saying go out and quit your job. But if there's a job that you've been dreaming for, get land that job first, then quit your job. And that's you know something that you would do to make you happy. A lot of people go out and look for love. They're looking for the love of their life. And, you know, they get hurt. They, they get tired. They hurt desperate. And they get depressed because it feels like no one likes them. But they, that person that you love, you'll meet them when you're doing what you love. Because when you're doing what you love, you'll meet who you love. And, you know, when you're out looking for a person, a lot of times you're not going to find that person. And a good percentage of people will say, yeah, well, I found that person out looking for them. But another percentage of people will say, well, I found the love of my life doing, probably most likely it will be doing an activity that they really like or doing an activity that they loved as a kid or as however old they were because the love of your life will come and find you. You don't have to go and look for them. And a lot of people, they just keep overanalyzing things and keep overthinking them. They don't realize life is simple when you do what you love. It's not that hard. 
and they overthink every little thing they do you need to stop doing that you just relax and do it make bold choices make really bold choices don't be afraid don't hold back whatever it is do it make that change even if you're scared to do it make that change because in the end i promise you it's gonna help you you know all emotions that you have are you know just they're beautiful crying laughing being happy you know you're gonna experience them with someone and when you when you do that you know you appreciate everything and you know this is kind of like me telling you well now you gotta appreciate everything but you know some people a lot of people some people i don't know if it's a lot but you know a little percentage of people it won't work out for them and they won't find that happiness because they don't want to listen to anyone so you know appreciate that you know you can at least try to find happiness and you know appreciate people that are trying to give you happiness and they're trying to motivate you to do what you love because those without those people a lot of people wouldn't be able to take the next step i'm not calling my per myself one of those people i'm just saying appreciate those people in your life that have motivated you appreciate your mom and dad i appreciate my mom and dad so much and i don't express it and i wish i really really did and you know it's hard for me to express it but show that you appreciate those special people in your life that have been motivating you because in the end without those people you wouldn't make it very far you know open you have to stay open-minded through everything you do in life you know being happy you know open arms and heart to new things and new people you know the new people you meet the new things you do you know some of them might give you happiness for you know eternal life forever and it'll give you you know it'll be it'll, the goal is to make you happy motivate you to be happy do the things that you love don't do the things that you're being forced to do or doing the things that give you a lot of money and you don't like them do what you like even if that means you're sacrificing something give that thing up because you're gonna meet some new people and you gotta keep your mind open to that keep your heart open to meeting new people and doing new things and you know everyone is different and you know even though everyone's different we're all the same at the same time we're all people and you know Find out from other people what their passion is, you know, share share with them because a lot of times, you know, you can share your passion with someone and they'll, they'll talk to you and they might have the, either, either the same passion or they might like, you know, you might be able to give them advice on their passion and you know, it's, it's a cool thing even though you might not be getting success or finding what you need out of that conversation with that person, you might be helping someone else and you know, when you share your your dream with someone else, it, it's really it's a really cool and special moment. Sharing your dream with them is such a special moment, and it might be a special moment with them because that dream might come true one day, and you might remember that person. And if it's the love of your life, telling them what that dream is one day, and that you think it's gonna come true, that's just a, such such a special thing and something that you'll never remember. And getting lost sometimes will help you find yourself you know getting lost and not knowing what you want to do your life decisions whether to cut this or that out of your life cutting everyone out of your life and you know you're gonna get lost but it helps you just find yourself and you discover new things about yourself every day and traveling you know traveling through all these things and traveling so often to do whatever it is you want to do making these big leaps of faith you know you're gonna get lost in it and i'm here to tell you and motivate you it's gonna be okay because you're gonna find out something new about yourself and at the end of the day and some opportunities only come once and if you don't make that bold choice and say this is what i'm gonna do to pursue my happiness and you don't go on the pursuit of happiness you are not gonna you know you're gonna lose that opportunity so seize those opportunities right when they come out. Don't just think about it and turn it down because it's something you have never heard of or something you're scared to do. Don't be scared about it. Do it. Make that bold choice. Live your life. Because life is about the people you meet, the people you see every day, and the people you interact with. And the thing is, the things you create with them are really special. The memories and everything that you create with someone are really special. And you want to be able to remember them. You want to rem remember all the happy times you had with them and cutting out all the negative times and how much of a better time in life you had when you cut out the negative, all the negative things. So you need to go out and start creating. 
create whatever, create a YouTube video, create this, create that, draw, do do whatever, create something in your life that's special, create something that will give you happiness, do something, do something for yourself. If you if you're a very family oriented person, or you do a lot of things for other people, go out and do something for yourself, create something for yourself. If you always dreamed of doing that YouTube channel, trying to make a YouTube channel, go out and do it for yourself, create something. And you know, maybe that something is gonna bring you so much happiness that thing might bring negative and might have ups and downs. But if that's something that you'll love, it's something that you'll never forget. Because life is very short sometimes and life is short, you know, life passes away day by day, you know. I felt like just yesterday I was starting high school, now I'm two weeks in. It's crazy and life is short, so don't pass up those small opportunities. Don't sit there and dread on wishing you could be done with something. Be done with it. Cut it out of your life because you need to live your dream and wear your passion because living your dream is a big part of your life and wearing that passion on your arm, in your heart, being able to tell someone that you now are living the passion. Oh, sorry. Pillow fell, but um, living, telling, being able to tell someone that you're living that passion when they say, hey, what's your passion? will say well I'm actually living it in reality right now and you can go and encourage them because you have now found so much happiness out of yourself and finding the passion something that you love to do and I think in the end if you do end up finding happiness I encourage you to please go and share it with someone else help someone else find it because you know making making things positive and cutting out all the negative is very important and sometimes it all starts with meeting new people and making bold decisions and keeping your heart open and a lot of people you'll you'll meet that you try to share with them they won't have their heart open and they won't be open to talking to you and the way you approach that is you share with them you know your personal experience sometimes sharing your personal story gets them to come out about their story and that's like a really cool thing in life is that the your personal life you could share your own experiences. So you might be looking to either me, probably not me, I'm not a very good motivational person, this is just something I whip together. But, you know, after this is all over, if you've gotten advice from somewhere else, or even if it is me, remember the things I said in this video, remember the steps you took and share them with someone else. Share your journey, share your story, share your passion. Someone, tell someone what that passion in your heart is because if you don't share it with someone else, they might not be able to find happiness and when you do this remember how the moment was when you finally achieved that happiness you achieved that dream you met that person that love of your life imagine how that felt remember how that felt share it with them because just sharing your story story could help them find that that's what i that's the message i want to leave with you be bold, be brave, meet new people, open your heart, share your story. What is your story? Share your stories down below. This has been a really cool experience making this video. I had to do a couple takes of it, but I've had a really cool experience making it. It was really fun, and I really appreciate the opportunity YouTube has given me to create. And moving on and creating what I want to create, creating something for myself, creating that business I've been talking about, creating that YouTube video I've wanted to create, creating whatever I want to do, you know, that's a big part of my passion. My passion is to be a YouTuber. That might not work out, but I need to keep looking for happiness and, you know, open, meet new people, open my heart to meeting new people. And I'm going to take these steps in this video and, you know, I'm going to do progression and, it, and I'm hopefully I'll make progress. But, you know, yeah, the reality is I might have a business, business idea. It might not work out, but I could start this business and it could go crazy. I could start doing something on YouTube and it could go viral and it could YouTube could have, end up being my job or I could do something it could go viral in a wrong way or I'm made fun of but I don't matter as long as I'm living my dream as long as I'm being happy as long as I'm pursuing what I want to pursue doing what I want to do living my life and getting that happiness that I want it's all good but once you do what you want think about the other people because this selfishness isn't gonna last because you want to be able to share it with someone else and being selfish for so long it only works for so long because then people start to cut you out and you don't want that but maybe you are that negative thing and if you do get cut out don't worry 
build your walls around you start cutting people all around you make yourself happy because i promise you if you're doing what you do that makes you happy you will meet that person again and even if you don't meet that person that just means they weren't right for you they weren't a positive person and that's the message i want to leave you with be positive make other people positive share your story this has been cole from the prank squad if you have any other suggestions for next week leave them down in the description or sorry leave them down in the comments below tweet us send us a snap whatever you want to do send us a comment on facebook whatever you want to do to share your story we'd love to hear it and if you want to if you want to share a topic that you want us to cover next week we will do our research and we will talk about it and we might even get to do a skype or whatever with you this has been cole from the prank squad prank squad out yeah.